veces aventurar tú. En ajá, tu... ajá, sí. <risa> sí, a veces creo que necesito menos cosas, pero... Pero no, es un gran aventura en sí. mi vida. <risa> Welcome to vlog number 48. I have something I need to tell you. If you haven't seen my last vlog, this may not make sense. But if you did, you know that I shared something vulnerable. And what I have to say is thank you. You have honestly changed me and I'd love to explain. But first, let's begin the day. Okay, all packed up here, ready to go. Leaving Sochi Toto and headed over to, guess what? A volcano crater, um, the inside of a volcano crater to go camp. Um, I'm gonna probably stop in two towns to check them out on my way there and then head up in to the volcano crater where there's now a lake and I'm hoping to camp next to. I think it's gonna be pretty sweet. So it's gonna be a good day. Peace out. Last para Para um, una volcán se ah. llama Cerro de Berlin. Cerro de Berlín. O tal vez se, se llama Alegría. Ah, Alegría. Ahí está una, la laguna. Hay una laguna allí, la laguna sí, muy bonita. El dentro sí, del sí, volcán. Sí, adentro del volcán. Sí, es bonito, bonito, ¿no? Sí, bonito. Sí, voy a acampar allá. Ah, bueno. <risa> sí. ¿Tú llevas cosas de acampar? Sí. Ah, Ajá, también. Cuando tú digas ya me retiro de. de... Ya has conocido bastante. Ajá, lugares. ajá, sí, sí, bastante, sí. Un álbum de fotos. ¿Yo? Sí. Sí, yo tengo una página de, de los sociales, ah, de todo, de Facebook, de Instagram, Facebook. de TikTok. También yo, yo hago videos en, ah, en sí. YouTube. Eso es mi. Este es tu Instagram. Aquí es. Ah. Más allá. <risa> Clave. El palito no lo Gracias, muchas gracias por todo. Qué bonito su lugar aquí. Gracias. Es muy bonito. Cuando tengas un tiempo de escribir algo bonito. ¿no? Sí, sí, en un video, sí, sí. Y voy a como poner la nombre también. Gracias. Pero qué bueno, muchas gracias. <risa> gracias, hasta luego. Adiós. Okay, we're off. And I'm gonna do a circle around the block because I know that, whoop, as I say that, damn. <laughs> that these cobblestone roads can be tricky and that's why I tried to take the easier route, but all right, here we go. Oh, what am I doing? See how these little things can be. Uh... All right, I can do this. Ah, oh, it's the steep. That's the problem. Oh man. Okay. All right. There we go. Oh, I know. But that doesn't look difficult at all on camera, but I promise you, it's technical. Uh. Ooh, okay. And we're off. This is the town plaza. Say goodbye to the town plaza. So I headed out to go to this lake inside an old volcano and camp there for the night and visit some towns along the way. However, per usual, things did not go exactly how I had planned. Alrighty, gotta get some gas before we go. Oh, uh, this is diesel. Gonna wait in the shade. Gracias. All right, all gassed up. Should be 
an easy ride today. The roads in El Salvador are very good and very nice. Um, I had heard that before I came here and so far it seems very true. So on this ride today, if you allow me, I would love to tell you how the vulnerability I shared in vlog 47 has impacted me in ways I never expected. First, I need you to know that there's a delay in the vlog, so perhaps the impact that you've had on me from last week's vlog doesn't reflect in the tone from today's footage. I hope that makes sense. And if you didn't see last week's vlog, I shared a clip from my helmet mic talking to myself, feeling really down about my perceived lack of success with the vlog. I was afraid to release the vlog, in fear of looking really dumb, because to admit that I was letting my mind get the most of me was hard. However, your responses touched me deeply, and I'd love to share what I learned. First, you reminded me why I started this vlog in the first place. It was always about expressing my creativity and because I love to make videos. Refocusing on that rather than the numbers made me feel alive again. Second, your words filled me with a level of appreciation I could have never expected. I realized that, yeah, maybe the numbers aren't so high, but gosh, look at all this beauty. I saw all that I do have and it felt immense. I believe that the pain of feeling like a failure actually has expanded my capacity to feel appreciation, like a rubber band. And there's nothing more I could ever wish for than to be in a state of true appreciation. Lastly, the experience of falling and letting others know allowed me to take the hand that you all provided to stand up again. And the miraculous thing is that on my own, yes, I've fallen and gotten back up many times. But with you all, I'm getting up so much stronger. I know it sounds cheesy, but I now genuinely feel stronger that I will not let my mind entertain those thoughts of comparison or defeat again. It is literally pointless to engage in those thoughts at all. So whether the vlog grows or not, I am so happy to be here doing something I love and getting to share it with you all. So thank you so much from the bottom of my heart for lending out a hand after a fall. I deeply appreciate you and you are the sweetest cherry on top of an already delicious cake. All right, this looks like a main road, I guess here. Stopping for cocoa water. Hola, ¿cómo estás? ¿Y tiene agua de coco? Sí, una, pero normal. Gracias. I see it in your eyes. Yeah, I can read the signs. You need to get away. It's time we make a change. You know you'll always have me Baby, I will always stay with you So put your trust in me We'll work it out, you'll see If we get in a car and drive someplace far Yeah, we could go for a ride We don't have to stop 
Hola. ¿Cómo estás? Gracias. Bien. Solo hay un restaurante, ¿sí? Ah, ok. <laughs> so, I didn't do a great job of vlogging this part, but I came here for a juice and to explore the town of Berlin. But during my pit stop, I ended up finding on Google Maps an incredible looking camp spot just outside of town. So I was intrigued. Perhaps for tonight, that would be an awesome camping spot. The only caveat was the reviews said the road up was pretty gnarly. So I was a little hesitant. Okay, I'm trying to decide what to do. I kind of want to go to this this mirador place, but I'm looking at some of the information online, like reviews and stuff, and people are saying like the road is really bad going up, and it's always so hard to to tell how you know bad the road really is and for a motorcycle is it harder or worse is it just that it's bad in a car it's uncomfortable or is it like extremely steep so on a motorcycle it makes that really even harder I really having a really heavy bike kind of annoying because if the bike were a lot lighter it would make a big difference it wouldn't be such a thing honestly sometimes just having to make so many decisions in a day maybe what I could do is just go to the street go to the turn off and just like walk it a little bit that's what I'm gonna do because for whatever reason I'm just feeling a little weird today and um, I think I need that that peace of mind and I know when I'm feeling like a little bit weak it's not good on the motorcycle so that's what I'm gonna do The turnoff is coming up. It's right over here. Mm, I mean, it looks like it could be fine, but you never know what it turns into. Let me pull over somewhere. Okay, the. P oh. oh. Hola, ¿cómo estás? ¿Qué tal bien? Gracias. Sí. Ah, okay. Yo soy de Nueva York. Quiero, eh, voy para el vista allá. Para los ¿Y cómo es el calle? ¿Es muy feo? Está accesible. ¿Sí? Accesible. Porque mi moto es muy pesado. Sí, pero entra. ¿Sí? ¿Y también cabañas? Cabañas no, no cabañas si no, son, no tienen disponibles. Es solo comida, café. Ah. Ahí no hay cabañas. ¿Y el, el calle es como... Es, Claro, la calle para arriba sí es una calle aparte plana y otra parte empedrada. Una parte que está algo empinada, así. Mm. A ver si puede manipular bien la moto usted. Si la puede manipular no va a tener problema. Sí, a veces cuando es muy, el, el calle es muy feo y muy subido, a veces es un poco difícil. Si a veces vienen vehículos, tal vez se puede perder el equilibrio usted. Sí, este... Ok, gracias. Ok, they said that there's no place to stay up there. I go up there to check out the views or not and oh, I don't know. Okay. Muchas gracias. Bonita día. Bye. Gracias. Okay. To go to the mirador or not. Okay. Shall I do it? You know what? Maybe I'll go up in the morning. <laughs> When I have not my stuff on, I'll go up in the morning for sunrise. Well, I basically chickened out. 
Without knowing whether I could camp up there, I just wasn't sure it was worth it. Usually locals have the perspective of riding a small light bike and it's very different than a big heavy bike. So it's always really tough to judge the information. And since by now it was already late, I decided to do the volcano the next day and stay in town for tonight. The good news is that this town called Berlin is pretty interesting. Oh my god, it's a little pig. Oh my god. Oh my god, it's a little miniature pig and he's so freaking cute. Oh, look at him and he's so dirty. Oh, look at that little bald piggy. Oh, that little piggy. Oh, it's a little piggy. Oh, that little piggy. Oh, I need to give him some, some, something. Oh, that little piggy, come. <laughs> Look. So the town of Berlin, El Salvador got its name because it was actually founded by a German. It rests up in the mountains about a thousand meters high and it's known for its coffee farming. And later I'll discover something really cool. But the ride in is surrounded by amazing views. <gasps> Here's the views, wow. Really, really beautiful. Oh, wow. So beautiful, those views. Finally, I arrived at a hostel in town and couldn't help myself but to ask one more time. También una pregunta. Um, lo encontré este lugar se llama Finca Mirador. Miramar. Miramar. Sí, eh. Pero puede acampar allá? Eh, no, igual es, oh. es bien solo. O no se puede, allá no se puede. Oh, no. Sí. Ajá, es que no, para acampar no hay. Mm. No es no se huh? puede acá. Okay. ¿Y la calle por subir está feo? Dicen que hay un, un parte. Vamos, una parte de la calle que sí es, es muy es feo. Está feo. Okay. Está, está bien. Ajá. All right. Today's plan didn't really work out the way I intended. I thought I found a really cool alternative plan, but got duped. So now I'm in this really lovely guest house. It's $30 a night, which is more than I'm used to paying, to be honest. Today I was caught by indecision and I don't know. I think I just had some like Sometimes I just get a little stuck in like feeling maybe a little emotional. I don't want to share that. Yeah, today I just, I don't know. I just got a little stuck. I don't know what to say. Yeah, today was just one of those days. It didn't quite unfold the way that I wanted. It wasn't quite as adventurous as I wanted. But at the same time, waiting for that noise to pass. But at the same time, this is also a big part of the adventure. It's maybe not so glamorous or cool or whatever, but um, yeah. That's all. I don't have anything really um, spectacular to say. Eh, una pregunta. Dígame. Le, eh, como la mirador. Mirador de acá. Hay, sí, hay, hay un mirador, ¿no? Y dónde es? Ven, ven. Ahí está en la esquina. Aquí, venga. En la esquina ven. derecha. Me 
a donde viene el muchacho, va a cruzar así para abajo, okay. ahí con mirador. Ok, bye, perfecto, bye, muchas gracias. Bye. Hey, there's a mirador over here. Gracias. Gracias, mucho gusto. ¿En serio? Sí, 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 ya, ya llega. ¿Con quién anda? No, para solo. Hola. Sí. Me llegué valiente. Sí, yo soy un ¿Qué viajero. ¿Qué le parece el clima? Ah, está muy... Es, 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 ¿Vamos ahí? Sí, voy por, por, Vamos, por la... Sí, sí, me encanta. Wow. Nosotros nos alegramos que vengan gente extranjera a visitar nuestra, ah. nuestro pequeño terruño. Ah, pero es muy bonito aquí. <risa> wow. Qué bonito. Alegría, sí. Pero um, es un poco difícil a ver en la cámara. Sí, viera que wow. aquí Ah, en una... ¿Qué, qué volcán? Claro, sí, ese es, es, eso es el volcán, ¿no? Viejo. No, no ese es un cerro. Ese es un cerro. Ah, sí. Mi respeto por usted, que es una mujer valorosa, <risa> guerrera. Sí, <¿verdad>? Eso. <risa> Gracias a ti. Um, they were so adorable, those two guys so sweet of them to want to take photos and show me the mirror door mirador sorry well a very nice thing about staying in this town when i didn't expect is that there's a whole lot of nice murals i always say that word wrong murals 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 paintings on walls um there's a lot and they're so nice and now that i'm just walking around i can totally admire them so check them out. Oh, Susanna, don't cry for me. We had some good years, so let me be. The world goes on. I sang my song. I gave my own true love for you to see. Oh, Susanna. I just asked a tuk tuk if they could take me to the mirador that I was deciding to go to, and he said he won't go because it's too fail. What's this life without a sweet goodbye? 